Hey guys, this is Vishal and I want to talk about a very important topic called trend following system. Why trend following is so important in your portfolio? Everybody who has made big money in the stock market ever has some or the other way used trend following system. Be it the Warren Buffett or the Rakesh Chujutwala have made a lot of money. They are following trend following systems on fundamental. Now we will follow trend following on technicals which is about more than 50% of my students in my portfolio is based on trend following system. So what is this trend following system? Basically we need to understand there are three types of trends. One, there is an uptrend. Then second, there will be a downtrend. And then third would be your sideways trend. Right? So we know that a particular stock will have an uptrend, downtrend and sideways trend throughout the year. Now if we keep trading the same stock again and again throughout the year, we will be able to capture all three moves. So in this up we will make money on the long, in this short we will make money on the short and in this sideways we will lose money provided we follow the whole system for the whole year. Now how does the math work? There is something called as positive expectancy of the system which I am going to demonstrate in a very very interesting way that how a trend following can work, what are the advantages of trend following and why you should be doing trend following system in your trading. So let's see this demonstration which is going to be very interesting. We are going to play a very interesting game. There is a pack of cards. I have 52 cards. And the rule is simple that every time you get king, queen, king or ace, you make 500 bucks. But every other card, you lose 100 bucks. So let's start the game. I'm, I'm going to shuffle this and start playing the game. This is like my first trade. Do I make money? No. I lost 100 bucks to the market. Then next card. Again, I lost 100. Then next card. I got king. So I'm going to take 500 rupees from the market. Then I got this again, I went 1000, that's lucky, lucky at the start of the year when you make good money, this is like January month. Then, wow, this is something amazing, this is like a dream run, in the real market it doesn't happen so, so again you lose 100, again you get 500, then again start playing, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 8 trades in a row, I lost 100, 100 bucks and I had to give to market and this is where your patience is going to be tested because this is exactly what trend following system is. You will have a, a string of whipsaws or losses or false breakout where you lose 100, 100, 100 and that's where you feel jittery, you feel impatient, you think I should switch the system or sometimes you switch the stock. Now this stock is like 52 cards, like 52 weeks. If you keep trading the same stock, you know that part of the month or part of the year it's going to be trended and rest of the time it's not going to be trended like this where you're going to lose money. So if you keep trading this, you know the trends will come but you don't know when it will come. So you, you have to play each card. So let's say after a string of losses, you switch the cards to something else like this one. I have another card and I keep playing there, there also I can have more losses so I don't need to go from Reliance to State Bank, I have to stick to Reliance only So because after a string of losses what's going to come is a trend, again I make 500. Now if you do the whole math, is like 52 cards, Queen, King and Ace, there are 12 cards, so 12 into 500 is 6000 or 6000 bucks. And rest are 40 cards, which are we are going to lose 100, 100 bucks. That's 4,000. So in spite of going wrong on 40 trades and right on only 12 trades, you are still end up making 6,000 minus 4,000, 2,000 rupees. And that's called a positive expectancy system. And that's what trend following system is. That's what we teach in top bottom trading system, which is a part of trading the program. The lessons which we learn from this is that you have to focus on one stock. You have to take each trade, each card, and you have to have patience to lose this small money so that you take the big trades in. You can't switch stock. You have to have patience. You have to focus on the process and not on the profit. It will become very, very boring. There is no prediction involved because you don't know when the trend is coming but it is coming for sure that much confidence we have and once you focus on the whole process of this game then you can master trend following then you become a money making machine 
and if and that's where it's called positive expectancy system the you have to play the game long enough to show you the profits so this is what i had to share in a very different and an interesting way how trend following systems work i hope you learned a lot from this make sure you share this video with as many people as possible to understand what trend following is and if you like this and if the lessons are learned you can put that in the comment section below this i'll see you in my next video good luck and good trading